what's going on your boy is back with another rendition of don Kappa eating good in the neighborhood what's going on i came out here to old stomping grounds in downtown harrison i really was in the mood for a nice sanguich body style wanted some casa di italia which i was craving but it was closed closed on sunday and monday love the owners over there don't worry i'll be back during the week make sure i get some of that stuff i walked up like two stores down i saw this place don Chu choose tacos and i'm like hold up let me see this real quick anytime i see some mexican food i gotta try it and i walk in and the place is just beautiful oh my god they recently renovated it i think like a couple years ago they opened like two years ago they recently renovated it uh the service was awesome was talking to the you know, a lady at the cashier and they're just so friendly in there and afterwards had a great conversation with this other lady outside and got into politics and you know Sunday is always good vibes good energy out here um, so I had to get some some good food and I started off with a little chimichanga I don't I mean I'm actually I don't know if I ever even had a chimichanga I guess it's like a burrito I have to ask my wifey um, what exactly they they put in it but i got like a steak chimichanga so it's like fried big old burrito please never eat from the middle of a burrito that is just against every rule in the book uh, when you eat a burrito just soft on the side oh my goodness wow they just pack like rice beans there's cheese in there steak Oh my goodness. And the lady was like, I'm like, you know, how, how big is the thing? I was like, is it the side of a burrito? She's like, it, it just depends on what you put in there. I'm like, I feel you on that. But this thing is really, really good. Wow. This tortilla is really, really nice. I'm guessing that they fry it, but it's got really good texture to it too. Wow. Hmm. That is delicious. The the cashier, the lady was, is like so friendly and she had one table that she was sitting with. And I worked at a restaurant before and I noticed that it was one of those tables where, can I get this? Can you help me with this? Can you fix the table? Can I get some guacamole? Can I get some extra sour cream? And she was the only one there and just bop, 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 bop. Yes, yes, this, that. And I love that. Like I'm a, I'm a fiend for great customer service. That's all I ask for. Even if the food is not like the best, you give me great customer service and I'm super duper happy. I had to get a little guacamole, which comes to have like eight ounce and a 12 ounce. Now I'm biased when it comes to guacamole because my favorite guacamole comes from my wife's mom, my suegra, Mama Rosalia. She makes the best guacamole ever. She has a secret ingredient. Can't tell you what it is, but it's so good. But I gotta try this one. This looks good. Consistency looks really nice. The place is, is actually pretty big too. A lot of nice seating. I love the layout. Right behind the cashier, there's like a kind of like a prep preparation desk, and they have obviously the in the back, basically kind of closed off, but there is an open window where they cook and everything like that. So it looks really cool. I love that. But this guacamole is fantastic. Wow, so creamy. Mmm. Got the tomatoes in there. It's very very tasty. Wow. This might be <laughs> not top, not number one. Ain't gonna disrespect Swagger like that, but this is definitely in the top five guacamole's ever had. This is really nice. No, it's funny. It's like sometimes you don't go, you come to one place with an idea in mind, and you end up trying something else. But you end up just getting finding landmines, gold mines. Last but not least, I had to do it. I had to get me some churros. Every time I come to a wonderful Mexican restaurant, I have to get me some churros. It's just a must. If they have it on the menu, I'm going to get it. And this one, they come with a little chocolate dipping sauce. Oh, man. You know, the secret to my heart is chocolate. I love it. Oh, my God. Look at that thing. Ooh. These are so crispy. Nice cinnamon on there. One bite. Everyone knows the rules. Wow. These are really nice, nice and fluffy. Have a nice crunch to it. 
inside is delicious. I love cinnamon, by the way. It's one of my guilty pleasures. Look at that chocolate. Oh, my goodness. Ooh. Wow. Well, that was incredible. What an amazing experience. Just finished the gym workout. Had to make sure I had a little Don Kappa Eats back at you. And I really appreciate everyone hanging out with me and listening to me. Um, appreciate all the love and all the feedback, all the comments and likes and, and watching my videos. And uh, I truly believe the best is yet to come. Uh, Don Chui Tacos, I have to give you a solid, solid rating. You can go 8.4 out of 10. Really, really delicious. That's definitely a, a great spot. That area, you got uh, Casa de Italia. You have the bagels and more bagels. You have, obviously, Don Chui Tacos. You have Pizza 2000 on the block. So I think Harrison is doing very, very well. I'm definitely proud to be from Harrison. Proud to be a Husky. Uh, so appreciate you guys. And uh, for next time, thank you.